guys, it's Heidi and it's Annie and today. So today we're going to be making some melting snowman. It's been on my to-do list since last year. I saw it all over Pinterest and I've been meaning to make it. So I'm so excited to finally get to it. So let's go inside and get started and make some. Okay, so for our melting snowman ingredients, we will need and one package of mint Oreos, one package of cream cheese, and you need about two cups of white candy chocolate. As well, I have the miniature Oreos and the miniature peppermint patties, which will be great for the hat. Sprinkles. Different types of glitter gels will work as well. Also, to hold the Oreo balls, you can either use a toothpick or a lollipop stick. Either way will work. So the first step is to crush your Oreos, and there's different ways that people like to do it. First, they either like to crumble it in a bowl like this, just break it up into small pieces. Another option is to crush these up in a bag. Or crush your mint Oreos in a blender. Now once you have all your mint Oreos in the blender, I like to put it on crush mode. So what I'm doing now is just moving it around to see if there's anything else that needs to be crushed up. If not, I'm gonna pour it into the bowl. So I went ahead and I chopped up the cream cheese into small pieces and we're gonna put it into the bowl of crushed up Oreos. Now I'm gonna use my electric mixer. You so here I have my cookie scoop and it's gonna give me the perfect size snowman. And all you have to do is just roll the dough into your palm of your hand and then here you have a perfect size snowman. So let's transfer this over to the glass dish. But you can just either stick these in the freezer as is or stick a lollipop stick in the Oreo. Here I have two cups of white chocolate wafers on very low heat and we want to keep stirring the candy melts until they're completely melted and nice and smooth. Okay, so I just took our Oreo melts out of the freezer. They're nice and cold. They're even sticking to the parchment paper. So now we're going to start dipping our Oreo balls into some melted white candy chocolate. I have a cookie tray here. I'm gonna line it with some wax paper. So here I'm putting a dab of white candy chocolate onto the tray, and I just like to dip my Ori ball into the warm candy chocolate, and give this a good tap to get rid of the excess, which will help make it more nice and smooth. And then when you're ready, place it onto the parchment paper. Put a dab of white candy chocolate on top of the head. Then place either the mini Oreo or peppermint patty onto the head. So now I'm gonna start working on the remaining Oreo balls and once we're finished, I'm gonna stick this in the refrigerator for at least half hour. I just want the white candy chocolate looking up nice and hard. Awesome, so now I just took the tray of snowman out of the refrigerator. You can see that the white candy chocolate is nice and hard now and now we're gonna start working on the snowman's face. So first let's do the eyes. then the nose, then the mouth. Arms, and the hands. So now we're going to work on another snowman and here we have some orange sprinkles which we're going to use for the nose and the easiest way to attach these is to poke a little hole and you can do that with a toothpick or even with a popsicle stick. Either way just you know so you have a little indentation into the Oreo and then then just stick the orange sprinkle into the face and it should hold in place. If not, just use a little dab of white chocolate. Okay, and then now I've just added on the arms and the mouth and the face and it's so absolutely cute doing it this way with the little orange sprinkles for the nose and I actually made an, another one earlier as well. So here are our melting snowman. Aren't these like absolutely so adorable? I think this one turned out probably the best. I love this one. I love being able to combine different colors and as well textures. And I definitely want to try one of these. So let's go outside and enjoy one. Okay, so here is my melting snowman. And I picked the one with the 
peppermint patty, the mini pet peppermint patty that's right here. Isn't he so cute? Yeah, he's so cute. So let's try it. Mmm. The combination of mint Oreo and white chocolate is just so good. Mmm. This is great for like, we have a holiday party. You know, a lot of people have parties after the holidays in like in January, there's kind of like more of a winter party. So this would be fun to serve. You know, these are so adorable, so cute. So my mother and I are planning for 2016 with lots of, we already have ideas for 2016 for recipes, but we're also hoping that we both could be in Denmark together at the same time in the summer. I'm not exactly sure when, but we are planning and hoping and just wishing and just trying to make it work. So we definitely want to do some food excursions when we're in Denmark together. Now, manga talk for 2015. You guys have been amazing and my mother and I literally every morning cannot wait to wake up in the morning and to see you guys, you know, exchange memories, recipe requests, thoughts, ideas. We're so, so super excited about our channel and being able to be connected with you guys. It's been so much fun to you know connect with every single day. So manga talk, tuzen talk, got new tour, happy new year, skull for alt, and see you in 2016. Bye guys.